I created part one in 2008. And uh, at that point, I was already doing a little bit of uh, exploration in, in vocal work. Uh, I had random images that uh, I brought into the process. The, the character, I knew it was going to be a character study, but uh, really, the, the woman first came out of the dress and the shoes. I really wanted the shoes. <laughs> it sounds terrible, but I went shop and like I saw the shoes in the window and I thought I needed those shoes. And um, the, the, the dress was in my closet and I put on a whack of makeup and there the woman uh, was born. Uh, the content of the solo comes from uh, a storyline that has been, uh, that was a, a kind of a theme in many of uh, my friends' lives and my life at the time, um, in a heartbreak. We, we've all experienced it. Uh, so I put that together with um, some songs that I've always wanted to sing, and that's where the, that's where she came from. Where the junction came from, I was driving to Ottawa with my sister, and there's a, a museum on, along the way called something like the, the Memory Junction Museum, and I, that, the title, that name has always stuck out to me. And so I, I was playing with that uh, in creating the title. The duet arose um, actually out of, I was planning to do a, a group piece initially for the dance work season, and just circumstances weren't um, supporting the creation of a, of a large group piece. It was actually Mimi, the, the presenter, the producer for dance works that suggested, well, why don't you, I'd like to see the solo again, why don't you do a small group piece in, uh, and we'll program that as well. And then my mind just clicked, and I thought, no, this is perfect. This is perfect. This is actually what's supposed to happen. And so I called upon Brendan to, uh, to be my partner for the response. I'm very blessed with my collaborators. Uh, almost all of them are long term. Uh, I've, for example, I've known and worked with Catherine Thompson for at least a decade. And it just keeps getting better and better. Um, Oh, with Brendan, uh, yes, he is a profound influence in the studio. More, this last stage of the process is going to be really um, uh, uh, focused on his character and the deepening and broadening of uh, who this man is. Be really cool. Yeah. No, actually, you want some pair of sunglasses? Like this, my boss. Come on.